we went to a little store called Hungry Ninja today and we got a bunch of Japanese snacks and drinks. So we are going to be trying those for you guys. What do you want to start with? So these are marshmallows with chocolate in them. It's very thick and fluffy. Very good. <laughs> I think. Really good. We should have been gone in no time. It's okay. For the marshmallow part over the top, but I am a chocolate lover. So, they also had these Fanta cans, and it's metal, but they have lids on them. As well as these pop bottles. With rum in here. I believe they have a marble in there. Actually, that is good. Mm -hmm. So this one actually just peels right off. Oh! So yeah, there's the marble. Look at the nice lid. Oh, that's cute. Took the cap off with it. It was like being a kid in a candy store. No kidding. Literally. I don't know. I think we're supposed to open it like this, but I'm not sure. See? No, you're supposed to pop it. The marble goes in. Oh, this stays on. <coughs> yeah, the problem is we don't have a table to use here. All this stuff is on it. Here. There it goes. I hate that freaking earbud so much. So you don't need this? No. So yeah, this is where the marble sits. That's so cool. Cheers. So this one's blueberry. That does not taste like a typical watermelon drink mm. or candy. I think I prefer the blueberry. I like them both. It's good. It doesn't taste like a tip doesn't taste how you would expect it to taste. No. Nope. It's good. So we also got these pizza chips. With the Italian flag. Is it? Yeah. <laughs> they look like ruffles. Yeah. Mm. Smells good. A lot of air. <laughs> as to be expected. It doesn't taste like pizza, but it's good. They're like softer ruffles. This will probably also be gone by tonight. <laughs> it's a pretty small bag. Oh, would you like to try? 
No, do you want to hear Alakai try a joke? Mm-mm. Uh -uh. I'm not feeling well. Just the small one. Oh, I like those. Mm -hmm. Go ahead. No, I don't want to. You were saying? Mm hmm. Those are good. I like them. This one tastes like pizza. They're really good. And you could tell are there others or something. And I assume it's a small owned store. And the state of the economy, like the prices are pretty freaking good. better than the state of the okay if you go to a walmart and you bought this stuff would be a lot more mm. we should go to tnt that one's fun too mm. i've been before tnt is a really big grocery store it's a lot of mm. <clears throat> it's all okay so we're gonna do the kit kats now this one's cheesecake flavor so this one's yours i'm just taking little bites because i don't want to fail what are you going to try? Wait. Try it out, guys. Do you want the first bite? <laughs> Cheesecake. How is it? pretty good for white chocolate. It's not as sweet as I expected. Oh, I don't really taste cheesecake though. This one is chocolate cake. Good, though. See they're all, I think we got 10 different flavors. It's hard to open. Ice cream. Orange. Put it down. It's this one? Chocolate cake. Mm. It smells like raspberry though. Oh my god, it tastes like chocolate cake. Give it a second. Oh, there's there's strawberry in it. That's better than the cheesecake one. Yummy. This one, strawberry milk. It's pink. It's like a peachy color. That's really free tasting. Mm -hmm. Oh, cute. Pink Kit Kat. The aftertaste is really tangy. You yeah. find? <sighs> what, strawberry milk? You can taste the strawberry. Mm -hmm. It's good. It tastes oh. like strawberry ice cream. I don't like that one. I love strawberry ice cream. <laughs> mm. That's not my favorite. <laughs> okay, we also got orange. If you've ever had Terry's orange, you know chocolate with orange is good. Are you a frog? Hmm? Your throat made a frog sound. Yeah, that was my throat. <laughs> oh my god. Ooh. Okay. 
It's very comparable to the Terry's. Except that has wafer. Mm -hmm. um, Sounds good. I don't even know what this one is. This one might be the shortcake one. Oh, I don't know what this is. That one's the white chocolate. Oh. Okay, so this is the shortcake, I think. This is yours. Just gonna do a quarter of it. Another white one, but it has little specks of, I guess, strawberry. It definitely looks like a face. Mm -hmm. The bottles are adorable. You might like that one. It's very tangy. Like, actually, that one tastes more like cheesecake than the cheesecake one. Mm. You taste the tang? Like the fruitiness? Yeah, it just hit. Eh. I prefer the strawberry milk. So, um, this one is the ice cream. No, I'm not a fan of the sweet or the shortcake one. Not a fan of what? The shortcake one. Tastes like vanilla ice cream. Oh, it smells like cake batter. Doesn't it taste like vanilla ice cream? Actually, that one's really good. Mm -hmm. Really good. <laughs> mm -hmm. I could eat a whole bar. This one's peach, so that one's also yours. <laughs> I know I'm not gonna like peach. She got me a peach bellini or something for my 18th birthday and I didn't like it. Oh, I like the color. Pretty pink. Matches my mic. Oh, I don't know if I wanna... Just take wow. What a bite. Really peachy. Oh my god. <laughs> it actually really smells like can fruit. smell this. It's kind of a peachy color. Yeah, it came on the other side. It's very fragrant. Mm -hmm. It's not horrible, it's just weird for the Kit Kat. <laughs> okay, so we have... Oh, it kind of makes me think of like a peach candle from <laughs> Bath and Body <laughs> So we have mint, we have white chocolate, and we have cookies and cream. Are we tasting them all? Yeah. So mint better be chocolate. Yes. <laughs> They had like melon, matcha, they had a whole bunch. They even had like Halloween ones. They had melon? Yeah. It was next to the orange and it was like... Oh. Oh, green on the inside. Mm -hmm. Kind of cute. I think we actually had mint for a while. Yeah. Mmm. Good. The nice thing about that one is it's not super sweet. Mm -hmm. It's not super strong either. Mm -hmm. So, which one? They're both going to be really sweet. Why don't we just switch to this for now? Okay. <laughs> so, these are little candies and they're Pokemon. They're what? Pokemon. This is Piplup. I have a Squishmallow them. That's what they look like. That's Piplup right there. I don't watch Pokemon. I just, <laughs> I like Piplup. Piplup. Piplup, Piplup. Are these hard candies? Yeah, they're little hearts. And they have Pokemon on them. It's like 
normal that I don't hear anything in the mic? Do you hear it? Yeah? Hmm. Some of them are oh, hurts and some are I was going to say, I thought they were hurt. Mm. This reminds me literally of the fruit dip, fruit and dip. You know you have a candy that you dip into the powder? Mm -hmm. This reminds me of the dip, the candy you dip. It's good. We can't chew, we have shit teeth. <laughs> it's very good though. I really like the chips and the marshmallows. Mm -hmm. I was like, pizza chips, what the hell? And then we're like, maybe we should just try it, but they're really good. Mm -hmm. They are. Except, this is a single serving bag, it's not a family bag. Yeah. And I think it was, I think it was $3.50. That's, we did get a bunch of Mario candies too. For my sibling. Mm -hmm. She's the Mario lover. Yep. Stickers and candies, gummies. Not much flavor. No. Pretty mild, not my thing. I think you taste a lot more if you like to bite into it. If you what? Bite into it. Ooh. And it's resealable, that's nice. Mm. You ready to try the chocolate? Sure. Which one? Oh, I, they're both gonna be so sweet. I can <laughs> tell you that right now. I have a higher tolerance. She'd put, if we got like Kool-Aid packets, the powder, she'd put one in her bottle, I'd put two because one's not enough for me. And then the squirt juice, I put a lot more than I probably should. Oh my gosh, this smells good. It not smells like cookies and cream ice cream. Take the candy out. It literally smells like ice cream. Very good. That one's really good. I think it's because I was expecting it to taste like the Hershey. Yeah, which that is one's... They're good, but it's a lot. Okay, so now it's the white chocolate that we were trying. The last Kit Kat. Ava's staring at you. It's That's interesting. Run. Run. Oh. Oh, is it vanilla white? Because there's know. specks. Like it looks like vanilla bean. Mm. It doesn't taste like much. I hope that's not mold. That's good, it's just a barely any flavor. Definitely not as sweet as I thought it was going to be. I don't know. I think the cookies and cream was one of my favorites. Yeah, that was really good. Excuse me. I liked the because yep. it tasted like ice cream. So now the fun top. I wonder if it tastes the same. I'm sure it does. It's just a much cuter bottle. Why don't we, and it's can, it's a can. Very good. It almost tastes like grape juice. Could be because I just had chocolate. It is carbonated. That was a very sweet treat. I think it might actually taste different. Really? I don't know if I've ever had grape flavored. Like I said, it could be because I just had chocolate, but it tastes like grape juice. Hmm. 
try it. We each got one and she got a I'm peach one. Almost afraid. <laughs> okay, because we had a not great experience with the other drink. Oh, it smells like medicine from when I was little. <laughs> Cough medicine. I used to love that. Oh my gosh, I love the mouthpiece. Maybe we should keep them, use them for water, keep them in the fridge, to keep them cold. It's not like overly grapey. Mm. It doesn't taste like grape fanta, I find. Mm. Interesting. Yeah. We also have some beauties that we did not get from the store, but I wanted to include because they're good. <laughs> I'm just breaking a bit. <laughs> Show the camera. <laughs> Taking a little piece. That was really we liked. It's a little more familiar because we really needed more chocolate. Mm -hmm. The orange chocolate was also really good. Yeah. I've just had too much at this point. My mm -hmm. stomach's a bit not liking me. <laughs> these, these were good. I didn't really like the first bite. When I finished it, it was the after taste of the chocolate was smooth and marshmallow was interesting. A little, little more, a little heavier than our marshmallows. Oh, very sick. Well, I didn't find it thick, just, you know, different. <coughs> Yummy. Mm -hmm. I think my favorite was the chips. Because I'm not in the mood for chocolate right now. <clears throat> These are nice. Did you notice any other flavors? No. Because my eye was on the Italian flag. We'll be back. Yep. We're head back to the store. And did you tell them what it's called? Hungry Ninja. On Maryville Road. I thought it was Hungry Panda. I'm thinking of the um, hmm. pot, not potluck. What's the all-you-can-eat restaurant? Buffet. Yeah, there's a panda. I don't know what it's called, but it's got panda in it. It's so cute. Mm, it looks like a little bird almost. Some people break the bottles just to get the marble out. Oh. Which is kind of dangerous. Yeah, you could literally just take the plastic off. Can you though? I don't know. I wouldn't. I like, I like it on. You like the watermelon better? Mm. I mean, I like them both. I'm very good. And I'm normally a picky eater, so I expected to go in and not come out with anything, but we got quite a bit. Like There was a lot of ramen. A whole aisle of ramen. Mm -hmm. There was one with Pokemon on it. 
they also had bubble gum right as you walk in and it had like anime on it one of them i think was spy family i think they were 50 dollars a piece it was it looked like bazooka me 50 bazooka. cents what did i say 52 oh my god 50 cents <laughs> yeah no 50 dollars um there was a whole section of ramen but then on the other side there was more ramen because they had big bowls they, they had also had eggs. squid yeah they had squid <laughs> Obviously not alive, but it looked like it was in the candy aisle. It wasn't. She was like, "What is this?" And she was squishing it. I was like, "That's squid." She's like, "Oh." Yeah. Next time we should try a meal food. I'm down to try ramen. <laughs> ramen. I'm a ramen picky eater. Yeah, but you've had ramen before. Yeah. Except I think it makes me nauseous. I don't know why. Oh, there's something about the texture I think you didn't like. No, it's not the texture. I think it was what you put in it. I have to have it plain. Oh, so just like it butter? It could be that or the broth. Like the the water. Yeah, but you don't have to put the powder in that makes the broth. Your sibling likes it just with butter and salt. That's good. So yeah, if you live in Ottawa, go check out I'm Green Ninja, not Panda. Anyway. Honest, honestly, I've driven by that store many times, and I thought it was um, collector stuff, like Funko, Funko Pops. Pops and cards, trading cards. I think there were cards, and they had some little night lights. I had a little section of playing cards. Yeah. The stickers, they also had One Piece key and Naruto keychains. Mm -hmm. Yep. It was a big enough store. Mm -hmm. We actually only went because we were killing time waiting for another store to open. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, well, I saw a cute little store over there that we could go look in. Because <clears throat> I noticed all the Kit Kat signs on the window. Yeah, I had seen those before and I wondered why they were there, but she made more sense of it than I did. Yeah, and it's a lot taller than you expect it to be, too. It almost looks like a warehouse when you walk in. Yeah, because the... The shelves have boxes on top of them. And they also it, had... It is like a... It's made like a warehouse. It is. And they had like a massive boba plush. And I mean massive because I have like 16 inch squishmallows. It was bigger than that. Yeah. Cute, cute little stuff. Interesting to check out if you're looking for something a little bit different. Yep. And try a little tasty treat. It's not just junk food. We just happen to just get junk food. Mm -hmm. So anyway, thank you guys for watching. And if you want my mom in more videos, comment and let her know. Because I've been bugging her to make videos with me for a while now. Anyway, thank peace. you for having me.